fire. That smoke, God, roaring in this place tonight, God. We thank you for the fire that comes to consume everything that's not like you, oh God. We thank you for the consuming fire that comes, oh God. My God, to refine us from tonight, God. In the name of Jesus, oh God. We thank you for taking us higher in you on tonight, God. We thank you for taking us in your word, in the name of Jesus, oh God. That my God, we will get clarity on tonight, God. For the things that we've been going through, oh God. For the things that the people have been going through, oh God. They will get clarity, insight, and understanding, oh God. For their situations on tonight, God. In the name of Jesus, oh God. We thank you now, God. My God, that no weapon formed against us, oh God. On tonight, will or shall prosper, oh God. And every tongue that rises up against us, oh God. My God, just seven and now. In the name of Jesus, oh God, you're severing it now, God. In the name of Jesus, oh God, we thank you that tonight, God, my God, as we go into Millionaire's Club, oh God, we thank you that you're opening doors that no man can shut, God, and you're shutting doors that no man, my God, can open, oh God, and we thank you now, God. We thank you for taking us higher, higher in your word, oh God, higher in you, Father. In the name of Jesus, oh God. My God, give us deeper depths and higher heights on tonight, God. Take us into your word, my God. Step by step, oh God. Line up on line, precept upon precept, oh God. In the name of Jesus, oh God. We thank you now, in the name of Jesus, oh God. My God, that you're creating us in your image and in your likeness all over again, oh God. In the name of Jesus, oh God. You're causing us to walk in the creative power of you on tonight, God. You're causing us to live, move, and have our being in you tonight, God. In the name of Jesus, we thank you that tonight, God, there shall be a word spoken, oh God. My God, that will cause the supply, my God, to be supplied, because according to your word, oh God, you said you will supply all of our needs according to your riches and glory, which is in Christ Jesus, oh God. We're coming tonight like the deer that's planted toward the water, so our soul will long after you on tonight. Like God, give us a longing and a desire for you like never before, God. In the name of Jesus, oh God, let us desire more of you, oh God. Let us desire more of your presence on tonight, God. Give us the desires, my God, to have you and only you, Father. In the name of Jesus, and through the working power of the Holy Ghost, God. We thank you now for immediate breakthrough and finances on tonight, God. In the name of Jesus, oh God, we thank Thank you now that that confused mind will be sane tonight because of the word, oh God, that shall come forth, oh God. That man that was double-minded, oh God, my God, you're going to bring him back in the single mind of Christ, oh God. In the name of Jesus, oh God, we thank you now, God. My God, blinded eyes will be open on tonight, God. We thank you now, Father, for miracles. Miracles are happening now. Oh God, and the wells of living waters are springing forth uh, in the name of Jesus, oh God. We thank you for the wells of living waters uh, coming forth now, Father, in the name of Jesus, oh God. We thank you for the eternal word, oh God, that you have already spoken, oh God, manifesting itself tonight, God. We thank you that the blessings, oh God, is making us rich and adding no sorrow, God, in the name of Jesus, oh God. We thank you for increasing our faith tonight, God, because you said in your word, Without faith, it's impossible to please you, oh God. And we want to please you tonight, God. Give us the faith that will please you, oh God. Give us the faith that believe like never before, oh God. That supernatural faith, oh God, to believe the word, God. Whatever you say, it is so, God. Whatever you, my God, will for our life, it is so tonight, God. And we thank you for what you're doing for Urban and Cypress on tonight, God. We thank you for what you're doing for the Facebook Live on tonight, God. In the name of Jesus, oh God, we thank you that continents will be delivered, oh God. My God, we thank you, oh God. My God, that states will be delivered, oh God. We thank you that cities, oh God, will be delivered tonight, God. My God, because of your word, oh God. My God, we come to stand on your word, oh God. My God, we're standing on your word, which is a sure foundation, oh God. My God, because upon your heart, you build your church, and the gates of hell will not prevail against it, oh God. And the 
the rock is your word, oh God. We're coming, oh God. Standing on the rock of salvation on tonight, God. In the name of Jesus, oh God. We're running after you tonight, God. We're running after you tonight, God. We're coming, oh God. With our pipes, oh God. We're coming now. Uh, ready to eat, oh God. Uh, in the name of Jesus, oh God. Uh, our Father tonight, God, uh, which art in heaven. Hallowed be thy name tonight, God. Uh, thy kingdom come, thy will be done. Uh, on earth as it is in heaven. Uh, give us this day, God. Uh, give it to us tonight, God. Uh, give us this day our daily word, oh God. Uh, give us our doses for tonight, God. Uh, my God, that we may run again. Uh, my God, run this race with patience, oh God. Uh, that we may run uh, to see what the end is going to be, God. Uh, in the name of Jesus, oh God. We thank you now for demonstrating your power, oh God. We thank you now for this demonstrating your majesty, oh God. My God, we worship you. We love you. We adore you, oh God. Come into the situation. We invite you in to the situation of our lives, oh God. We invite you in, oh God. My God, to the lives of the Facebook people on tonight, God. We invite you in to Irving and the Sanctus, oh God. We invite you in. Move Move on tonight, God. My God, we thank you for moving in this place tonight, God. We thank you for the download of the glory cloud. We thank you that the glory cloud is in this place and it's resting, oh God. In this place and in us, oh God. In the name of Jesus, oh God. We thank you for the line, the tribe of Judah, roaring tonight, God. We thank you for the lion, the tribe of Judah, roaring in this place tonight, God. There shall be a great praise. There shall be a great worship on tonight, God. In the name of Jesus, oh God, we thank you for doing it, oh God. In the mighty name of Jesus, oh God, we thank you for signs. We thank you for wonders on tonight, God. In the mighty name of Jesus, oh God, we thank you now, Father. In the name of Jesus, oh God, my God, in the name of we thank you now, God. My God, that you're moving in eternal power, oh God. In the name of Jesus, oh God, we thank you now, God. That the lives will be changed, oh God, because of the word. Because you said in your word that you come by, that we may have life and that more abundantly on tonight, God. We thank you for life and that more abundantly on tonight, God. In the name of Jesus, oh God. We thank you now, God. In the name of Jesus, oh God. We give you praise. We give you glory. We give you honor. For you are God and God alone, oh God. We thank you now that you're going to do exceedingly and abundantly the above <coughs> <coughs> What we can think or even ask, oh God, according to the power that worketh within us on tonight, God. We thank you tonight, God, that we've never seen the righteous forsaken, nor it seen the begging bread on tonight, God. In the name of Jesus, oh God, we thank you now, God. Mended marriages are, oh God, are here, oh God. Covenants, oh God, my God, that have been broken with you, oh God. My God, the covenant, oh God, agreement is coming back together, oh God. In the name of Jesus, oh God. We thank you now, God, my God, for the spirit of truth, oh God, being released tonight, God. My my God, we thank you, oh God, for the spirit of truth being released tonight, God. In the name of Jesus, oh God, we thank you for Elohim, oh God, being in this place tonight, God. We thank you for Elohim, my God, Elohim, my God, being in this place tonight. We thank you for Jehovah Jireh, Jehovah Tiskanu, Jehovah Rapha, being released in this place tonight, God. In the name of Jesus, oh God, and we thank you tonight, God, that our ladder shall be greater than our former, oh God. In the name of Jesus, oh God. God. We thank you, Father, in the name of Jesus, oh God. My God, that the water, oh God, is being poured out, God. We thank you, we thank you now, God, for the water that shall gush from the altar tonight, God. My God, that shall cause us to drink like never before, oh God. Because in your word, you said we shall drink from the wells of salvation on tonight, God. In the name of Jesus, oh God, we thank you that the wells of living waters are springing forth tonight, God. In the name of Jesus, oh God, we thank you, Father, that you're doing a 
new thing. Uh, shall we not know it, oh God? Uh, my God, and it shall spring forth quickly, oh God. Uh, in the name of Jesus, oh God, uh, we thank you now, Father. We beseech thee now, Father. We present our bodies as a living sacrifice, uh, pure and holy, uh, and acceptable, oh God, uh, which is thou reasonable service on tonight, God. Uh, in the name of Jesus, oh God, uh, my God, open up our ears to hear what the Spirit of the Lord is saying unto the church tonight, God. Uh, open up our eyes to see, oh God, uh, my God, uh, where you're taking us, oh God. Uh, my God, we thank you, oh God, for elevating us, oh God. Uh, my God, into a new portal, oh God, of you, oh tonight, God. Uh, we thank you for the portals being open, oh God, uh, the portals of heaven, oh being open tonight, God. And you're pouring, you're pouring out your spirit tonight, God. In the name of Jesus, oh God. Because you said in your word, you're going to pour your spirit upon all flesh, oh God. On tonight, God, we thank you now, God, that you shall see nothing but the blood. Nothing but the Nothing but the blood. In the name of Jesus, oh God. We shall see the blood of Jesus, oh God. We plead the blood new God over our minds and our hearts tonight, God. We plead the blood down, God, over each and every one that shall grace, oh God. My God, the Facebook live, God. My God, we thank you now that you shall we plead the blood, oh God. As they're driving home, listening, oh God. As they're sitting in the living room, listening, oh God. As they're sitting on their jobs, listening, oh God. We plead the blood tonight, God. In the name of Jesus, oh God. We plead the blood, oh God. God. Let your blood cover us, oh God. Let the blood of Jesus cover us on tonight, God. That all you see is Jesus, oh God. Jesus, oh God. Jesus, oh God. In the name of Jesus, oh God. We don't want to be on sin, oh God. But we want you to be seen, oh God. We want you to get the glory out of our lives tonight, God. We want you to receive the glory out of our lives tonight, God. In the mighty name of Jesus, oh God. In the mighty name of Jesus, oh God. And we thank you tonight, God. For your will. For your eternal power, O God. For your eternal life, O God. We are given on the night, God. Because you are the life giver, O God. My God, you can reject situations. That's the life, O God. In the name of Jesus, O God. In the name of Jesus, O God. In the name of Jesus, O God. And we thank you tonight, God. We give you glory tonight, God. We give you praise tonight, God. For you are the Lord, my God. And you will be at the time. You are the beginning and the end of the time. And everything in the middle of the time. You are the first and the last of the time. In the name of Jesus, O God. You are the head and not the tail of God. You are above and not beneath, O God. My God, we thank you now, Father, that we're blessed in the city on tonight, God. We're blessed in the field, O God. We're blessed in our coming and in our glory tonight, God. We thank you now, God. We thank you, Father. In the name of the Lord, my God, we thank you, Father, that we are blessed tonight, God. Blessed to be alive tonight. Blessed to be in your presence tonight, God. For now, unto him that is able to do, my God, you're able to do exceedingly and abundantly above what we can think or even ask, oh God. According to you, the power shall work you within us, oh God. You're able to do it, oh God. You're able to change situations on tonight, God. You're able to deliver minds on tonight, God. You're able to deliver addictions on tonight. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Glory to God. Father, we thank you. Father, we bless you. Father, we praise you. We glorify you because you are God, and beside you, there is no other God. We thank you, Lord, as we gather together tonight. We gather together in unity. One is in one accord. We pray, Lord God, you have your way. Move by your spirit, Lord God. We bind the hand of the enemy now. We come against any distraction, Lord God. Anything that would try to come and hinder. Anything that would try to come, Lord God, and not allow this word, this teaching to come forth on tonight. We bind it. We apply the blood now over every ear gate. We apply the blood now over every eye gate. We apply the blood over every hands and, and feet, oh God. That we will be able to touch what we're supposed to touch. And walk what we need to walk, Father. We thank you for this night. Night, Father, for this is a night, oh God, that you have ordained. This is a night that you have, Lord God, set aside, oh God, and we thank you because it is you, Lord God, and we praise you in Jesus' mighty name. God, I thank you and I bless you. Praise the Lord, everybody. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord, everybody. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And don't forget, just go ahead and share. Go ahead and share. And go ahead and invite. We thank God uh, for you, 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 and you. 
This is our millionaires club. This is the time that God has given us to set aside to come. And um, he told me to bring it and sit down and begin to do the Bible expansion. And so I'm excited because God has been dealing with me uh, regarding the word. He's been dealing with me regarding the very things he is doing in the earth. He already done it in the heaven, but he's doing it in the earth. And for that reason, we need to really posture ourselves. Some of us, you know, I'm not even going to really go there because some of us don't even know what's happening because we still, you know, in a, in a grade that we shouldn't even be in, in, you know, any longer. So, but those that are ready, you're going to hear from the spirit of the Lord and you're going to know what God is talking about. Hallelujah. So go ahead and grab your Bibles, grab your book, get, grab, grab your paper, grab your pen. And so therefore we can get ready to go into the word of God. Hallelujah. Amen. So we thank God for Prophet Sykes praying. That was him praying. You might not have seen him. You don't need to see people when they're praying. Just you can hear the prayers of the righteous man availing much. And God will begin to do uh, what he has said he was going to do. And so we are excited for you, 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 and you again. Glory to God. And so, hallelujah. hallelujah. Glory to God. Amen. Is anybody ready? Are you ready? Yeah. Yeah. Anybody ready? Glory to God. Ready for this word? Amen. We thank God. God is good. Hallelujah. <laughs> Yes, Lord. Amen. We got neighbors. Amen. <laughs> Hallelujah. What well, we had neighbors before, we can holler. Amen. But we got to be mindful. Amen. God is still good, and we can still praise him, but we got to be mindful. Amen. Of uh, of our neighbors. How about that? Hallelujah. Amen. So, Amen. Um, for this month, we shall be in a series, and the series of September uh, in our Millionaires uh, Bible Expansion uh, is going to be a series now, and the series is time to go back to the top of the mountain. Time to go back to the top of the mountain. Time to go back to the top of the mountain. And so uh, go ahead and type that down there at the bottom. Uh, yes, time to go back to the top of the mountain. I said it's time to go back to the top of the mountain. We need to understand why God put mountains, the word mountains, what did he mean when he put mountains in the word? It's not just when you see a mountain that's considered something that's trying to hinder or block, and then you speak to the mountain, and then it'll cast out. There's more to it about a mountain, and we need to understand what is God saying about going back to the mountain? And so I say to you, you need to go ahead and invite, you need to go ahead and share. Glory to God, and we're excited for this time. Again, it's a series, so I'm not going to be teaching the whole entire thing this night but that that you shall get this night i believe it will carry you into other days and you just have to search the word out and go deeper but tonight we are talking about it's time to go back to the mountain thank you deborah shelby uh for uh typing that uh thank you lakeisha sneed i see you thank you shannon haynes i see you uh-huh thank you sykes i see you uh-huh glory to god greetings daughter uh, go ahead and type time to go back to the top of the mountain come on donna white glory to god there's a word before i get off donna there's a word that god um had given me to give to you and also i believe that's your daughter there's a word that god has given me and before i get off glory to god i pray i remember so i can give you that word amen for nick nicole yes time to go back to the top of the mountain uh-huh jasmine smiley time to go back to the top of the mountain uh-huh Elena Murphy, time to go back to the top of the mountain. Uh-huh. Come on. Glory to God. Amen. Write it down. Get, it's time to go back to the top of the mountain. Yes, 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 yes. Mm-hmm. And so it's time to go back to the top of the mountain. And, and to those, uh, especially, I think I've seen Connie on here. Um, uh, when we sit up under, sit up under authentic prophets and apostles uh, they have they have that all of the prophets and the apostle in their life which mean they're not or we're not just going to be talking about cars and houses we have to begin to bring the people into the kingdom of god uh, is anybody listening yes. did everybody go home and this Amen. is why if we do not prepare our minds a lot of us going to get left behind yes. because we just want our rent paid we yes. think god and church is just a rent paid place we think it's just a car paid 
saved place. You know, I'm saved. So, you know, he said he'll pay my car payment. No, he said he would supply. Come on, supply your yeah. every need. He would supply it. Now, what would he supply? See, uh, did he say he was going to supply the money? He said he would supply the need. The need can be, watch this, the need can be you going to get a job and he Jesus. making the way. However, he said he's going to supply. And so because sometimes our thinking is low, the Lord is raising up apostles and prophets in this hour. Glory to God that has a mandate on them to teach and to preach and to prophesy the totality. And we can't just sit here and keep skimming over prophecy. That's why everybody wants to prophesy. That's why everybody is running to the mic and trying to prophesy. Mm -hmm. That's why everybody's trying to run to the pulpit and try to go get a church and all of that. But reality is, listen, Jesus said, I left. I left gifts. He left gifts. It's just more than one gift of what? Prophet. It's more than just a gift of what? Apostle. Nobody, amen, more than a gift of a pastor. Mm -hmm. It's a teacher and an evangelist. And then it has the gifts of administration, things of that nature. But because it looked, the enemy got the prophetic looking so beautiful that everybody don't understand their assignment. We don't understand our assignment. Just because you're a prophet and apostle, you still need to know your assignment. Yeah. Are you listening to yeah. what the Lord is saying? I was beginning to study uh, uh, study and, and, and begin to listen to some different teachings that is regarding uh, the, the prophetic and the apostles and the mountains and all that good stuff. And you have to understand that some of us don't even know our assignment. Yeah. You don't even know your assignment. You may know your assignment to be a greeter, but you don't know your assignment and what dimension, watch this, or what uh, area in the realm of the spirit you're supposed to prophesy. Y'all not saying Come that to on. me. Glory yeah. to God. You don't know your jurisdiction. You don't know what the prophetic mantle is on your life for. You just see everybody prophesying, and so you see everybody prophesying, so then, therefore you copy. And reality is, you're not even in the will of God. You're outside of the will because anytime God's called you a prophet, he's going to give you the assignment connected to the prophet. Anytime he says that you're an apostle, he's going to give you the assignment to be an apostle. Is anybody listening? Yes. Did everybody home? Uh, did everybody go home? That's why uh, church church is all jacked up because we don't understand where we're supposed to be. And to those that do understand, we want to call them crazy. No, they're not crazy. They know their jurisdiction. They know what they have been called to do. Glory to God. But I heard the Holy Ghost just show me a picture and the Holy Ghost says some of y'all need to come out of the barrel with the crabs. Oh, yeah. Glory to God. Because there's too many people in the barrels with, with uh, crabs in a barrel and you got to understand crabs that's in the barrel, they climb on each other and when it looked like one crab is about to get out. Somebody just pulled them down. Glory to God. Listen, I'm not talking about people pulling you down, so please don't get all yeah. hot up. see you right, because they don't want... No, 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 no. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Calm your spirit. Right. Calm your spirit. You have to understand that the calling, that the assignment that's on your life, glory to God, there is more to it than meets the eye. And if you don't spend time with God, and if you don't get in prayer, come on here, and if you don't get in the Word of God, you will not know. Are you listening? Yeah. Glory to God. There are apostles that have been set for, watch this, set for the region of the politician. Y'all not saying that. There are apostles that set for the region. Yes, we're to come in and we're to break ground, but what ground are you breaking? What is it? What assignment did God give you? What? I'm, boy, shot, da, da, boy, hi, yeah. See, I'm not going to get a lot of amens because that just messed up your assignment because, you know, you wanted to go ahead and grab the briefcase and, and put on your little, you know, cloak, hallelujah, boy, shot, da, and get up there and start prophesying. But you got to understand there is no power to you if you don't know your assignment as why God called you to be an apostle or a prophetess. Jesus. God, I thank you right here. Hallelujah, Bosaya. Glory to God. And I'm going to say, is it frozen? Is it messing up? Glory to God. It's freezing. Yes. Come on here. Glory to God. It's moving now. Amen. Yes. Uh -huh. Start typing. Just start typing. Amen. We're going to break this. Glory yes. to God. Hallelujah, Bosaya. Yes. Uh, Cyprus and Irvin is more to us than just sitting here. That's why we don't have time to be fighting. We don't have time, <laughs> amen, to sit here and, you know, big eyes, no little use. You got to understand who you are. And you got to understand and make sure that you are are not crossing over into illegal, illegal waters. Oh are you hearing me? Yes. It don't it, Just because the oil is on you, there are places in the realm of the spirit you can't go to. Come on. I said there are places in the realm of the spirit you can't go to. Yes. Yes. You have to be called by God. You have to be ordained by God in order to go into certain into certain places, into certain realms and dimension. And I know it looks good, but what I'm coming to do tonight in this series of September, glory to God, is to give us clarity and understanding about 
the mountain. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's time to go back to the mountain. Well, there's times, Apostle, we got to go to the valley. Well, I'm not talking about that. When I'm getting ready to talk about it, it's not about you going to the valley. In other words, you got to understand what God called you to do. There are many teachers at the school, but the teachers know their assignment. You don't have everybody teaching one subject. That's the problem. Glory to God. Everybody trying to teach the same subject, but yet God has not called everybody what? to teach the same subject. You have a math teacher. You have an English teacher. You have a Spanish teacher. Shall I go on? But in the kingdom of God, in the body of Christ, we got one teaching. Y'all not saying nothing. Yeah. No, I teach what God gave me. No, you don't know your jurisdiction of what you're supposed to teach and how far you can go in the teaching because I'm telling you, there's an authority and power that is on you and if you don't operate in that power and authority of that jurisdiction, nobody's going to get delivered. They all going to be hyped. Nobody's going get set free. They all going to fall on the floor and roll over and we're going to keep on throwing throw claws because why? We don't understand what jurisdiction I am in. Y'all not yeah. saying nothing to oh, a sister. Yeah. Glory to God. I'm telling you, it's time to go back to the mountain. And so I began to study and I began to look at different uh, uh, teachings and tapings and things of that nature. Uh, one of the teachings was, was Cindy Trim. One of the tape teachers uh, I was looking at was Miles Monroe. Glory to God. You, you got to understand. Y'all not saying nothing else as well as the the Bible. If you don't know who you are, that's why you have to be careful in trying to come up against someone yes. that's in a high-ranking yes. jurisdiction. I don't care if you think they ain't got nothing. I don't care if you don't think, glory to God, they like you. You cannot come up against the jurisdiction of the ranking of where God has placed them. I'm getting ready to talk about this. Y'all let me know if this stuff is freezing, whatever. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Because the ones that need it going to get it. The ones, amen, that say, oh, this ain't nothing. She's talking about the mountains. Ain't nobody. And that's why you're going to keep fumbling. And that's why you're going to keep hollering. Don't nobody want to give me a chance. 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 I sound like what? A broken record. Because that's how we sound. Are you hearing me? Don't nobody want to give me a chance but the problem is it's not that don't nobody want to give you a chance you don't know your jurisdiction Come on, mother. And what God has called you to do. Is anybody listening or did everybody yeah. go home? You have math teachers, but there are what? A, a basic math teachers. There are algebra teachers. Can I go on? You got to know your jurisdiction in teaching. Are you hearing me? Yeah. And glory to God, you looking at, okay, they lift your hands, lift your hands. And I see, I see that a car is coming to you. Come on here. Well, they, God may be giving you that, but you never tapped in to the jurisdiction. He put the oil on your life. Y'all not saying nothing. Glory to God. I don't know about Sonia. And, and listen, uh, 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 Irvin and, and, and Cypress, y'all better recognize how that both say. Because you won't ever get the jurisdiction if I don't know mine. But you better See? believe I know mine. See? And if I know mine, if you wait a while till I teach you and get you to the place, Come I on. reveal to you where your jurisdiction is at. You're not just any old pastor. Y'all not saying Come nothing. On. You're just not no any old teacher. You're not saying nothing. Yes, the Bible is what you teach from. Yes, God will give you the revelation. But at the same time, token, God wants you to learn your jurisdiction. Your jurisdiction. Come on, mother. But heaven and earth was created by God. Heaven was created in rankings. Heaven was created in protocol. Y'all not saying nothing. Glory to his wonderful name. That's why, amen, children are coming out of protocol. Children are coming out of ranking because the atmosphere, glory to God, has shifted. Y'all yeah. not saying oh, nothing. Mama. And we sitting here crying about Trump when God said, I put him there, but I also put jurisdiction. Y'all, come on here. We either going to get this right or we going to close the Bible and go sit down until somebody raise somebody up and really teach us what we need to learn. Uh-huh. Ain't nothing wrong with going to theology school. Go on, boo. Learn all things. Inside, upside, outside, all that. But guess what? Your jurisdiction is not coming from man. Your jurisdiction is going to come from God. Nobody is saying nothing to a sister father. Glory to God. I don't care how you prophesy. I don't care what you see in the realm of the spirit. There is a place in the realm of the spirit you have not been ordained to tap. Come on, mother. Come on. Come on now. Y'all not saying nothing. Yeah, yeah. So I was sitting there. Look how awesome God is. Mm -hmm. I was sitting there, and I was looking at a clip. At a double side, and, and here it is. Cindy Trim was talking to uh, Prophetess Bynum in this clip. It was the front line. And she was talking to Prophetess Bynum. And she began, I'm talking about, yes, it's time to go to the mountain. <laughs> 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 Woo, glory to his wonderful name. How about Shonda? And so uh, she was talking uh, to Prophetess Bynum, and she began to talk. And when she was talking, she began to talk about 
rankings and jurisdiction. Mm -hmm. She began to say, watch this, the, 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 the little ants, the little ants, the little ants, the little ants, the little ants. You can cast out some ants. Come on here. Glory to God. And she began to talk about the rankings of different uh, uh, angels and, and the fallen angel. Watch what she says. She says, uh, glory to God, uh, because an angel of a fallen angel cannot come to somebody that has not had that rank in the earth. That fallen angel must rank with the person in the earth that they trying to take down. Y'all not Jesus. saying nothing. That's why some of y'all don't even know. Go to God. And because you see it, it looks so good. You trying to go in out of your jurisdiction and you trying to handle something big and you about to get your head knocked off. Don't let nobody fool you and don't let nobody sit there and set you up. I'm trying to help us tonight. And so she began to say, glory to his wonderful name. I told my house up. Yes, I did. And she began to say, there's not many few people, watch this, can stand toe with Satan. See? Because the ranking of a demonic spirit, a fallen angel, has to come to the ranking of whoever is on the earth. Hold on. Mm -hmm. So I'm not telling you not to go to theology school. Go do all that. But when it comes to jurisdiction, it comes to ranking, that's coming from God. So she begins to say, there is three people that she know in the word of God that has stood toe to toe with Satan. Jesus being one. <laughs> Y'all not saying nothing. How can you say that? Because why? He what? Went up on top. Yes. Are you hearing me? And what? Satan tried to do what? Deceive him. Mm -hmm. He had what? Jesus. Watch this. All things is under Jesus' feet. Are you listening? Then she turns around and say, the next person is Job. Y'all not said no nothing. Mother. Ooh, no yes. mother. Glory to his wonderful name. Yes. Uh -huh. Then the third person she said was Adam and Eve. Why? Because these rankings, Satan came to each one of them. She said, she said, all I know is of three. I jumped up out of my seat and said, I'm the fourth one. I can't talk for everybody, no but mother. I know I'm the fourth no one. You would say, how can you say you're the fourth one? I'm so glad you said something. I'm glad you asked. Well, when I was with my pastor in Illinois and being submitted to him in Illinois, glory to God, and learning the things of God and, and, and staying humble, come on here, somebody. One night, I went to sleep. Y'all not saying nothing. All of a sudden, I went into a dream, and the imps came. Well, the imps tried to get to my leader, but the imps could not get to my leader but because of me. The yeah. imps, who was the imps? Demonic spirit, yeah. glory to God, yeah. came, tried to get to my leader, couldn't get to my leader, went back to Satan. Go ahead, mother. Went, y'all not saying nothing. <laughs> went back to Satan and said, we can't get him because of her. And her family, which was my children, because they was connected to me. Watch what he says. He said, don't worry about it. I'm going to deal with her. He couldn't deal with me unless my ranking was connected Ooh, with his. Come on, mother. So, uh, was, uh, okay, he came. And then about two to three years later. No, not even two to three. It was about a year and a half later. I'm now in Arizona. Mm -hmm. I'm now ready. Y'all yes. not saying nothing. Yes, Glory to God. So when I fall asleep, amen, and I wake up and I'm turning, there's an old figure in the mirror. Mm. The old figure that's in the mirror said, I'm going to get you. Oh, then who was that saying, I'm going to get you? The one that said it a year and a half prior to. What am I saying? Don't nobody got time to play. You better know what ranking yes. you have. Y'all yes. not saying yes, nothing. Mommy. Glory to yeah. God. Uh, no, no, no. No, boo. No, boo. I'm not trying to puff myself up when she began to reveal yes. glory to God. And God had already, amen, yes. caused that allowed me to have the experience. I don't yes. need man to tell me, That's oh, right. you don't have that ranking like that. Yes, you yes. you wasn't you weren't all the way in God. You wasn't taught like you taught now. No, 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 no. Because God knew, watch this, God knew set. September the 6th, 2018, I was going to pick up, uh-huh, pick up my iPad and begin to study. Are you hearing me? He already knew that I was going to study. And when I studied, he began to reveal. Y'all not Ooh. saying nothing. 
I don't have time to play. Oh, Is anybody listening? Yes. Did everybody go yes. home? I said, I don't have time to play. Some of y'all on here, glory to God, you're trying to please man. And the demon that keep fighting you, I know we talk about cycles, and cycles are, are real, and cycles are true. But some cycles that you're going through, you could be able to take that demon out. Yes. But because you keep playing yes. with your life and your lifestyle yes. and the things that you're doing, you can't take this spirit out. Yes. <laughs> uh -huh. Tell him that, Holy Ghost. He said he will put no more on you than you can what? Bear. Yes. yes. No, boo. I'm not pumping myself up. I just got a revelation yes, that when he spoke, he spoke it back 20, over 20 some years ago. Mm -hmm. This is the ranking. And if you yield yourself and if you sell out and stay sold out, you will move quickly in the rim of the spirit. Not trying to be seen, not trying to be heard, but let everybody see God and hear God. Y'all not saying nothing. And that's why when people look and say, she ain't got nothing, Ooh. baby, don't go there. Don't go you there. Don't go there. there. Don't, don't go to... there. Is anybody listening? Yes. No, those are not fighting words. Those are words that are from Zion saying, you don't want to go there with me. Why? Watch this. There was years when I came mm -hmm. to Texas. Then I'm going to go to this word. There was years when I came to Texas the first time. Glory to God. And, 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 and Prophetess Bynum was at a service. Yes. She calls me out. Y'all not saying that. Yes. 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 She calls me out. I'm sitting on the front row yes. and she said, everybody from her row to the third row stand up. Yes. And she told me, she said, you come here. When I came, she said, not everybody from the first three rows, and this was a big church, yeah. from the first three rows, everybody get behind her. Yeah. Yeah. And she said, everybody that just got behind you is the what the angels, the host yes. of angels, yes. which means I can turn around, y'all not saying nothing, yes, and tell God. one angel to come and deal with a situation, y'all not oh. saying that, in my jurisdiction, y'all not saying that. That's why people try to keep pulling you down, amen, they want to talk about the past and talk about this, and that's not where your jurisdiction is at. Oh, Are you here with me? Yeah. And I'm not raising up no punks, y'all not oh, saying yeah. nothing. Glory to God. You want no punk in the world, but now you got in the kingdom of God. Now you want to be punky. Y'all not saying nothing. What you mean I want to be punky? Because you sitting here trying to play with the devil. You still, you sitting here trying to go out with the devil. You sitting here and trying to marry the devil. When the devil don't mean you no good. Because if you ever come into the knowledge of who you really are in God, you wouldn't play with that booger no more. You will be beginning to cast him out. Y'all not saying nothing to us, sister. I came back. See, come up, 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 shine down. And so, for that reason, we're going to stop having church like we've been having church. Y'all yes. not saying nothing. Yes. Glory to God. Yes, have praise and worship. Yes, have prayer. Y'all not saying nothing. Huh? And even in prayer, I don't want to hear no cute prayers. I'm sorry. Yes. Glory to God. Because we got to overthrow some things. Yes. We got to begin to go and do legislation of laws. Y'all not saying nothing. Mm -hmm. huh? You ain't got to just go to the White House. You can stand where you at and overthrow some laws. Y'all not saying nothing. But yes. We sit here and have these little, Father, we thank you. We oh Lord, just bless. Mm -mm 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 -mm. That's because you don't know your ranking. Yeah, yeah. But tell your neighbor, glory to God, tonight I'm going in prayer. I got to find out. I got to find out where my ranking is. Glory to God. And be ye careful about finding out. Because when you find out, you're going to be judged according to the place you ain't operating in. Y'all not saying nothing, huh? No, God ain't gonna sit there and judge you according to, to what you don't know. He judge you according to what you know. And if you have not died to that place, he's not gonna wink at you because you asked the question. Y'all not saying nothing. So now he has to judge you according to what he revealed to you. So play if you want to. Go back and lick up the vomit of what God delivered you from if you want to. Come on here. Yes, I want everybody on here to go and ask God tonight. But make sure you're ready. Are you listening to what the Lord is saying? Y'all not saying nothing to a sister. Uh -huh. That's right, Kelly. When she said, I'm going into prayer tonight. I need to find out what my, my jurisdiction is. I need to find out what my ranking is. Come on here, somebody. Yes. Uh, so the, the imps could not, they couldn't handle me. And he didn't send another, another, uh, 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 another uh, fallen angel. Mm -hmm. He came. He said, I'm coming myself. So, come on now. Come on. He said, I'm coming myself. Yeah. Y'all. Go ahead, mother. Not saying nothing. Go ahead. Let me say this again. Yes. God will not put no more on you than you can bear. I know, Pastor, because you know I've been going through it. I, God will not put no more on you than you can bear. Because if whatever's trying to come on you, you have the ability and power and the jurisdiction. Yes. Okay, let me go ahead, because this is a series. Go ahead, mother. 
So we ain't finna sit here and get it all in tonight. Yes, ma'am. So you better be taking notes and you better highlight stuff and you better circle stuff. So when yes. you go back, you have this right here. Father, in the name of Jesus, come on, Jesus, prepare me because you're going to show me. And I need to do what? To be prepared. Yes, ain't no yes, sense of nobody, ain't no sense of no apostles and prophets to be jealous, come on, of each other. Y'all not saying that's, nothing. You got a social apostle. Y'all not saying nothing. Y'all y'all not saying that. We jealous. We jealous of what? What what, what we jealous of? <laughs> There's no way I should be jealous of you that you can go into a jurisdiction in the realm of the spirit and overthrow a law, and I'm gonna be jealous of you, and you gonna be jealous of me because I can overthrow some and bring some into manifestation. Come on here, somebody. Come here, my apostle. I'm trying to bring us up and trying to bring us up yeah, and out and well. Guess what I'm trying to take us to? The mountain. The top of the mountain. Uh huh. Are you hearing me? So now, now watch this. Now watch this. I'm going to give you an, a, another. This ain't no dream. This is reality. So um, what is it, about maybe about four or five years ago, this is before I actually moved to California, and I came to do a revival. Next door, the church is the church is like a, a like a, a what's that a little mini mall so to speak. But on if, if, if I'm facing this way to the church on the left side, but if I'm coming out the church, it'll be on uh, if I'm coming out the church, it'll be on my left side. But if I'm looking at the church, it'll be on my right side. On my right side, glory to God, there was a bar, a juke joint. Y'all not saying nothing. Now, if you could imagine in your mind, not people dancing and drinking, but seeing them spirits jumping all over each other, climbing all over each other. I'm not talking about what the people were doing. Are you hearing me? Because we don't understand. Though we see one thing, that's not how it really looks. Anybody ever seen a gremlin? Yeah. Yes. All right. Well, Gremlin, them them little ugly creatures, they ain't talking some go head. They jumping all over each other and they hitting each other. Why? Because they trying to do what? Take authority. They're trying to take jurisdiction. So while we seeing people at the bar drinking or on the dance floor dancing or somebody over there in the corner talking or somebody over there trying to get their little hat on, that's not what that's not what's really happening. What is happening is you got a, a house outside full of demons. Crawling all on the house. You got a, a, a land full of demons all on the floor, all on the ground. Y'all not saying nothing. Yeah. Inside it, why? Because it has been set aside for the kingdom of darkness. Y'all not saying nothing. So when people come in, they get drunk, they start acting a flu, they start acting crazy, all that. So therefore, it's not the way we see it. Are you hearing me? Y'all not saying that. And so we had a revival. They called me in to have a revival. Y'all not saying nothing. Now, who in the world having a revival got the mic preaching the word of God and somebody from the bar, somebody from the bar comes to the church and said, we can't enjoy ourselves for whoever's up in there preaching. Interrupting, y'all not ahead, my yes. brother right here. I'm not making this up. You not to so tell now, them. Now watch this. Yeah, watch this. And then yeah, they called the police. Called and the police came in and they coming to us <laughs> and said, Y'all making too much noise. Mm. <laughs> that's what the bar said <laughs> next door. And we begin that's right, Larissa. We begin to laugh <laughs> yeah. at the devil. Yes, then did. I turned around and I began to walk in my jurisdiction. Yeah, you did. And I began to say, this bar right here will be no more. What? Yeah. What? No. You shut the people down? No. I shut the demonic forces down. Y'all not it. saying that. Yes, and because of the authority that God has given me, yeah. and I know I can shut businesses down that is ran by demons, y'all not saying well, that. Hey, mother. A bar. Oh, oh, tell him, tell him, tell him. Tell a bar? Him. A bar? You sure did. A bar, y'all. Yeah, a bar. Drinking, cussing, fussing, and everything else that comes out of a, a bar. bar. They called the law on us. Yeah, are you hearing me? And then because the Lord had me to speak in my jurisdiction Go ahead, mother. and shut it down. A week to two weeks later, a week. when I came back later. to minister, I said, well, what happened to the bar? <laughs> the bar was no more. Can See? I tell you what they put in the place? You of the, tell us. They put in the place of the bar a fire. 
place. A fire. What is it called? A fire station. A fire station. <laughs> Y'all not saying nothing. Okay. I just want you to know we're going back to the top of the mountain. You can't afford to know your jurisdiction and then play with the chickens. You can't afford to know your jurisdiction and then go waddle in the pig's pen with the pigs. Y'all not saying nothing. Yes, the Bible says, do not cast your pearl to swine. And I'm not going to do that because all a pig is going to do is take the pearl with his, with his pretty self and gorgeous, take it and put it in the mud because it has no value. The pig don't have no value. Right. But yet we want to hang with people like that. Right. And your, well, you think you somebody. See, dead Lord, you got to help me right here because folks, I'm tired of folks saying I think I'm somebody because I'm nothing without God. But when you know who you are and That's who it. you That's are it. and That's where it. you operate from, it's not that a person uh, think they, they better than you. It means that there's just some places. Oh, t tell them that. All right, we'll do. Here we go. The Bible says uh, that e e Eli Elisha says to his servant, take my staff and go put it on what? The boy that was in the bed dead. Yeah. Yeah. It should have did something. Should it not? Yes. Well, he took the staff, mm -hmm. but where, the, where the, the servant was was not in the realm where Elisha was. Y'all not saying That's nothing. Good. Are you hearing me? He just went to do what was told to, for him to do, mm -hmm. but nothing happened. Elisha had to go in and go what? Nose to nose, mouth to mouth, hand to hand, feet to feet. Uh, Y'all not saying nothing. Glory to God. Then got up and start walking in the jurisdiction of the realm of the spirit. Then he gets back on mouth to mouth, nose to nose, hands to hands, feet to feet. He gets back up. He walks in that rim again. Y'all not saying nothing. And when he did it again, the Bible said the heat came back to the child and the child sneezed and got up. Why? Because it's a jurisdiction that only certain ones can walk in. I'm trying to teach somebody. When you know, ain't no sense you trying to drive a semi-truck and you don't have license for it. You can't drive it like you drive a car. Buckle your seat though. You can't drive it like you ride a bike. That's why you got to take the test that deals with what that type of semi does. Y'all not saying that. that then is. you got to take the road test. It's still a series, so don't act like I'm going to tell it all. I may just leave you like I may just leave you like Michael Jordan. Hang time until next Thursday. Okay? Get it. Understand it. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. So, you have to understand, when you, y'all got to learn how to tell people, babe, that's out of my jurisdiction. Okay. Oh, no, you can pray. Oh, yeah. no, 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 no. I know I can pray, but my, 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 my intercession, until God changed my ranking, I can't hit that right there. Y'all, yeah, I guess I got a few people, on, you know, that understand what I'm saying. And y'all letting people put y'all in places that you ain't been fortified that you have not been oiled nor mantled to walk in. But I'm getting ready to help all of us. Because if you don't go tonight and begin to inquire of the Lord, where's my jurisdiction? Are you hearing me? That's why you have mayors, you have governors, y'all not saying nothing. You have senators, you have congressmen, y'all not saying nothing. Glory to God. And even though you have one in every state, they still can cross over into another man's jurisdiction. They can call and give information and it's up to that jurisdiction to handle what is wrong. Y'all not saying nothing. And if you want to get, watch this, the White House in it, it has to go with protocol. Y'all, I keep trying to tell you, but now let nobody make you your authority. I'm trying to tell you. Why? Because you walk in a place, in a realm of the spirit where demonic spirits are at. And if you have not been fortified for that type of spirit, it's going to take you down. Are y'all ready? Yes, Mother. Mm-hmm. There's seven mountains. Write this down. There's seven mountains of influence, or the seven spheres, S, 
P. Someone said, well, you know what? I'm I'm a writer, but I'm gonna, I'm going back on here because you know, yeah, but still write, still write. You gotta learn how to shorthand. Amen. Write a little something and check it and know that when you go back, mm -hmm, that's it right there. Come on here. There's seven mountains of influence or seven spheres of influence, which shapes our culture. Well, y'all, you know what? Y'all ain't in our culture because we African American. Ain't nobody talking about that. As a matter of fact, I had a dream. This woman in her dream, well, just say what you want to say because uh, that's how he deals with me. He deals with me in dreams and he deals when he just speaks to me because I believe that I speak face to face and mouth to mouth to God. How can you say that? Because I asked him. I thank you, Lord, for gracing me to speak face to face and mouth to mouth to you. Is that not how he talked to Moses? Please don't mess with a sister. It's in the word. It didn't say it was just for Moses. Right, right. Hello, but you got to be willing to die to that place yeah, where you can yeah. speak face to face and mouth to mouth to God. Y'all not saying nothing. Yeah. And so he can either give me a dream or he can speak in my ear or he'll speak face to face to me. Y'all not saying nothing. Glory to his wonderful name. So you have to understand, my God from Zion, that when I had this dream, I had this dream. There was a couple of people uh, that was in this vehicle with me and uh, as we was in this vehicle there was this long bridge it was a long bridge and it was a like a double decker bridge you had the top uh the top part of the bridge and you had the bottom bridge and you had cars at the top and you had cars at the bottom and so i was at the top and there was you know either you one way going that way or you coming from the other way and we was crossing over from one side and it wasn't nothing but a body of water so this was a stretched a road are you hear me on one side of me is water on the other side is water so you know you better know how to drive and you better get fear out of you you know because this is a long way across and so we're driving i'm going somewhere so we're driving and all of a sudden as we drive i turn around and i look when i turn around and look in the midst of it glory to god was a gas station but as you drive it, you don't see the gas station. <laughs> All you see is bridge. Are you hearing me? All of a sudden, we stop out of nowhere, and now we're in this cafe on the bridge. I get out, and I am walking, and I'm looking at my surroundings. So I'm looking for a booth for us to sit down so we can eat. And so I began to walk towards where I saw the empty booth. When I walked past this one booth, there was a man and there was a young boy. This man and this young boy, if you can't take it, you better, take, you better get off right now. This young man and this young boy was connected to the Ku Klux Klan. Y'all not saying nothing. So when I walked past, I looked. When I looked and walked, I stopped and walked and stepped back. When I stepped back, the man or the father switched places with the child. The man did not have on the attire of the Ku Klux Klan, but the child had the hat and the attire. What was God saying? The generation that's going to come up is not going to hide who they are. But because I spoke, I said something to him, he switched real quick. When I spoke, spoke to him, glory to God, then all of a sudden it shifted. Y'all not saying that. Well, why would you tell us that? Because Ku Klux Klan is what? They come up against the Jews. Y'all not saying nothing. It is a prejudiced spirit. It is such a prejudiced spirit, y'all yeah. not saying nothing, yeah. that is in the earth. Y'all not saying nothing. And if we that is in God don't know our jurisdiction, you will go tampering with something in prayer, intercessor, glory yeah. to God, and begin to mess your mind up and wondering how your mind got jacked up. Mm -hmm. I know you may be an intercessor, but you better know your jurisdiction. Because mm -hmm. when I stepped back and spoke, glory to God, they begin to d dissolve. Y'all not saying nothing. Why? Because God is saying I'm taking you to the mountain. When I'm taking you to the mountain, I'm getting ready to reveal everything who you are and what you're getting ready to overthrow mm -hmm. in a legislative way. Y'all not saying nothing. But we too busy running after the prophets. We yeah. too busy running after the apostles. Mm -hmm. And reality is God show me who I really am. Yeah. 
Is anybody listening? Yeah. Or did everybody go home? Yeah. Well, let me take let me tell you one more dream and then I'm gonna go ahead and finish. So I go to sleep and I fall into this dream, and this was years ago. When I fall into this dream, glory to God, I'm on top of a mountain. I'm standing on top of a mountain and I'm looking down and saying, how did I get up here? It wasn't no short mountain. It was a high mountain. Y'all not saying nothing. Mm -hmm. And when I look down, I can see the houses. And I can see where there was light and, and the lights was not uh, 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 beaming with much power. Are you here with me? Mm -hmm. When God takes you back to the mountain, you won't play with it. Y'all not saying that. Da, 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 da. Glory to his wonderful name. Yeah. Are you hearing me? Yeah. There is seven mountains of influence. The problem is we don't understand how to use the influence. We want our influence to be used for favor to get us another car. We want our influence of favor, y'all not saying nothing, to get us in another house. When reality is he has given you the influence to overthrow certain things in jurisdiction and legislative, where laws have been what? Decreed. Okay, how about There are seven mountains of influence or seven spheres of influence, which shapes our culture. Watch this. Culture is the social behavior and norms in a human society. It is the way of life. Do anybody ever see a uh, glory to God that on certain uh, days of restaurants you have a society of women, older women come in and they got what? They got red hats. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I said, not yeah. the glory to yeah. God yeah. from Zion. And mm -hmm. when they come in, they all wear all different color hats, but the color is red and it is considered a what? A society. Yeah. Are you here with me? Yeah. Which means they gather together, watch this, all around the world. Yes, they do. Glory to God. On a certain day at a certain restaurant. Yeah. Are you hearing me? Mm -hmm. And they are sitting down because this society, this way of life that they have, they're coming together. And because some of them don't know that they have the influence to overthrow things, they sit there and talk about whatever it is they talk about with the red and purple, red. Hats and purple. That's their color. Yeah. Yeah. Are you hearing me? I'm getting ready to do something in the spirit. What you been to do? Clonk somebody upside the head? Because why? If, a, if a older women can get together as a society and say, we're going to wear red, red hats and put purple scarves on. And this is going to mean whatever it means. It has some power with them. And watch this. Not only do it have some type of power with them, they have influence over the restaurant and say, we got y'all table ready, and we're going to give y'all your discount. <laughs> but if you do not come in with the red on as the group, we cannot do what? Give this to you. Y'all not saying that. Yeah. So why would you say it like that? Because a lot of us, I told you, uh, I believe that was yesterday, a couple of days ago, we act like we're long rangers. Mm -hmm. uh, you, you can't be a long ranger. Y'all not saying that. Because I'm reminded that when I stayed in Arizona and had my church, that's when my church first started. <laughs> and there was a young man that came and had a book bag, and he came in the house of God. <laughs> and uh, myself and uh, Prophetess Turner, we happened to be there, and Sykes was somewhere in the midst, or might have been at work on his way uh, to the house of God. And so uh, the guy comes in, and he's, you know, trying to talk, not talk perverted or nothing like that. Well, the spiritual man, the antenna, came up, <laughs> and we begin to charge him, not jump on him, but to begin to charge him in the spirit, not charge him to live right, but begin to charge that spirit that was trying to kill him. Mm -hmm. Because we was working together. It wasn't a girl, you go ahead, I'm just going to sit over here, you know, when you're done, you go ahead and call me. No, no, no. That's not what it was because you got to learn how to do what? Work together. And so all of a sudden, this young man said, Ladies, ladies, I got to go. And I said, you right. You got to go. We casting you out. That booger, yes, Lord, he he, he left his book bag sure and ran out the door yes, and never did. came back. What you say? Glory to God. Because when you operate in your real jurisdiction and people know you operating in it for real, 
they ain't finna come to none of your service. It may be, it may be, Mama. you know, crowded, but it ain't gonna be packed. Are you here now that somebody wanna really get delivered? I'm tired of living like this, so I'm finna go up in it. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. But those that don't wanna get delivered, don't wanna know you ain't finna have a, a packed uh, a service. So why you crying? Why you crying? Why you crying? Why you getting upset? Well, God, I thought about, yeah, I just thought you was gonna fill the house. He said, mm, a lot of them not coming because they don't want you to cast them out. A lot of them not coming because you're gonna have to go toe to toe with that jurisdiction spirit. Y'all not saying nothing. And they both shot down. And so stop getting upset when people act like they don't want to hear you. Because yeah. reality is Nicodemus came by night. Some people are going to come by night. Y'all not saying that. They know you got the goods. They know, glory to God, you can cast this type of spirit off of me. Y'all not mm. saying nothing. Come on, mama. You have to understand that these mountains that I'm going to talk about, that I'm going to teach for the entire month of September, you can't be playing. Are you hearing me? You got to make sure that when whomever ordained you and whomever put you in, glory to God, in all these titles, you better know your jurisdiction. Y'all not saying that. Y'all going to make me take my glasses off. Are you hearing me? My God from Zion. That's why, glory to God, Cyprus and Urban can't come and try to do my thing because that is not their jurisdiction. Jurisdiction? Are you hearing me? Y'all not saying nothing. But I'm not trying to, you know, take your spot, Apostle. Boo, you can't take my spot. This is what you don't understand. Why you look it in the physical and act like you could take my spot in the physical, you cannot. Because what I'm talking about is spiritual. And what I got, I got it from God. And God ordained me and gave me, watch what he did. He gave me where I can walk it and where I can't walk it. So I don't have time to come down with the little chicks. What's wrong with y'all? She thinks she, well, that's your problem yeah. because I got to be up here with the eagles. Y'all not yeah. saying nothing because I got to deal with something up here in the realm of the atmosphere while you down there with them little chickens that can't fly. They can't even do nothing but peck on the ground. You ain't supposed to peck on the ground. The ground's supposed to yield to you. I just said something. Yeah. Anyway, Ooh, the seven good. mountains, you have influence, but if you don't know your influence, then what are you doing? Women, we have influence, even, even if we wasn't saved and even if we weren't anointed. There's influence that came with a woman when God created a woman. That's why you can bash your lashes. <laughs> and, you know, they be halfway falling out after service. Hallelujah, Shonda. That's why you can do your little switch and twitch. Y'all not saying nothing. Mm -hmm. That's why you can put your hands on your hip. Come on, here, somebody. And then the, the men, are you hearing me begin to look and say, mm, that's good. You, why? Because there's an influence on women. Are you hearing me? There is influence automatically in a certain realm on a woman. Y'all not saying mm -hmm. nothing. Mm -hmm. But I'm not talking about that. But I'm giving you what? Clarity. Mm -hmm insight and understanding so if that be the case why are we tripping if that be the case some of y'all got people praying for y'all that is not even in that jurisdiction to overthrow the law that came to say you shall not live but you gonna die y'all not saying nothing you dealing with it I, I, what anybody can pray for me no anybody can't pray for me ain't nobody said nothing no anybody can't pray for me no you could pray for me like you know you pray in general but you can't really, why? Because where I operate, you're going to have to face the demonic forces where I operate. And if you have not been fortified, y'all not saying nothing. I ain't going to play with no prayer. What's wrong with y'all? You better sit down and learn from me. How about that? That's it, Apostle. You talking. How about that? Uh-huh. And if I say pray for me, then what happens is because when uh, the, the prophet told his servant to go and tell the king uh -oh, uh -oh, uh -oh, this, uh -oh, the oil that, that was on the prophet came on the servant. And the serpent did not understand that and went and did his own thing. When he comes back, the prophet said, did you not know my spirit went with you? That when you was operating, you weren't operating in yourself. You was operating in my spirit. Come on. Okay, come on here. Moses, take out 70 people. And allow your spirit to come up on them to help you with the work. But this is the area where they can't touch. Okay, they can't touch. And if they try to touch it, they going to get it. Y'all uh, not I saying know. nothing. <laughs> so can I help about three of y'all with something? Yes, I don't want to bother apostle. Well, why you running bothering other people? Some people don't have 
that authority in that jurisdiction on, to pray with you yeah. and to cast stuff off of you. Okay. Y'all not saying nothing. Yeah. You can sit here and turn it off if you want to, and you can sit here and, and shake your head if you want to. Go on and try to be a sergeant, and, uh, tr to try to have boot camp, and then try to work in a sergeant capacity. Mm. Uh -huh. Okay, just saying. Just saying, because seven mountains, here we come. The seven mountains are these. Watch this, y'all. Again, what are we doing? A series. series. And I can't do what? All no. tonight. Okay. All right. Here we go. <laughs> the seven mountains are these. The mountain of education. That's where truths and lies about God is taught. And we know that to be true. Why, not just in Christian schools. They're teaching about the goodness of the Lord. Because even in other schools, they're bringing all these crazy books and trying to get in the public school. Well, my children, the Lord told them, your children can't go to the public school. Your children cannot go to the public school. Y'all not saying nothing. Mm -hmm. Well, your children must be all that. No, this is what you don't understand. God will provide for your child to go to a Christian school if you trust and believe him. You got a prophet and an apostle and a teacher. Y'all not saying nothing. Mm -hmm. Come on here. And a bishop. How you doing, life? Come on here. And a pastor that you raising up and you putting them in the midst of all types of spirits. Y'all not saying it. And though they're, though they're operating and you say, ooh. Yep, God is on you. They're not fortified. They're not strengthened. Are you hearing me? And some of y'all going to have to bag up and say, God, I'm, I need you to give me the money to put my child in either private school or Christian school. Y'all not saying nothing. Mm -hmm. Glory to his wonderful name. Yeah, yeah. Why? Because in public school, they let everything fly. They yeah. teaching all types of stuff. Yeah, Are you yeah. hearing me? That is against the will of God. And they calling it education. Yeah. Are you hearing me? Yeah. But the Lord said, that's one mountain. Are you hearing me? Yeah. That we're supposed to do what? Take yeah. jurisdiction. Yeah. Huh? Everybody can't be behind the pulpit. Ooh. Everybody can't prophesy behind the pulpit. Everybody cannot be behind the pulpit. Somebody is going to have to go into the education system. Y'all not saying Enjoy nothing. The second one is the mountain of media. Is that not ironic that the Lord is bringing this out today when media, come on here, Facebook and Twitter and whatever else that I have not called yet is considered on the media and we're going to get to media. Are you hearing me? Mm -hmm. That's where information is. Watch this. It is it's interpreted through the lens of good and evil. Mm -hmm. I said it's interpreted through the lens of good and evil. That's why half of us don't watch the news because they're trying to interpret evil. And then when you find out something <laughs> good and say, now why didn't this get on the TV? Right. Are you hearing me? And God is saying, I want y'all to get in this mountain of media. Well, I do it at my church, Apostle. So I think that, no, he allowing you to do it at the church because he want you. Glory to God, to go into this media realm and begin to overthrow the jurisdiction and legislations of things that is not being seen. Now, see, when I was coming up, and to those that's on here, when we were coming up, yeah. glory to God, there was Andy Griffin. Y'all not saying, no, I don't like all what, see, this is what you don't understand. At least Andy Griffin, they wasn't in the bed. At least Andy Griffin, when I do look at Andy Griffin, my God from Zion, I ain't got to turn the TV. Come on here. Because while I'm looking, somebody took their clothes off. Not on Andy Griffin. I'm just trying to give you an example. What, what is another one? Come on here. Dick Van Dyke. Little House on the Prairie. Is anybody listening? As a matter of fact, what is Dallas? Dallas, Dallas, Dallas. That's the name of it. Dallas. And then there's another Knott's one. Landing. Knott's Landing. Y'all not saying that. And there were so many more. Heart to heart. Mm -hmm. Heart to heart. There's many things that you can begin to type up. Glory to God. You can sit there and you can watch it come on here and what they're talking about <laughs> is family they're talking yeah. about you could family become guys. rich are you hearing me but today all they want you to do yeah. is to get high all they want you to do is to get drunk yeah. and all they want you to do is take your clothes off and roll around in the bed i can't be watching that stuff yeah. glory yeah. to god i like the four brothers watch this i'm gonna help you oh. i like the four brothers but i can't watch that movie yes because by the time I be sitting at them, come on, y'all, get get the devil. See. They done cussed so, so much. Okay. They done made my spirit say, I can't watch this. 
y'all not saying nothing. So what has happened is the media has not through the lens is interpreting. That's what's happening. And we sitting here telling myself, girl, I'm just going to go to church, and then I'm just going to work at Kentucky Fried Chicken. Well, don't you see how God is putting this all together? Because he said on Wednesday that you all need to go find jobs that you can get elevated Mother. in. Y'all not saying that because you got to be able to do what? You got to be able to change laws. And a lot of us, we talk about people in the world because we scared to step out. Come on, you know, mother. okay, I'm going to step out on faith and get this job. It's more to you stepping out on faith and getting a job because you got to go into one of these mountains. Okay, glory to God. Huh. You all the Watch this. Hold on, y'all. Hold on. Hold on, everybody. Okay, this don't want to come out, but don't you worry, I'm going to get this on. There we go, see. Mm -hmm. Got a marker, and I got a um, board. Y'all see this board? Yes, ma'am. It's plain Jane, right? Mm -hmm. All right. Here's your mountain. This is you on your mountain. So, but in... Your mountain that you own is seven, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So, seven, I, I, I ain't said I was, I, you know, so don't be sitting that time. Apostle, what's that? These are seven mountains. How about that? Amen. Lights. And so, you up here now, this way you at now. Because now God has brought you up. Remember I told you I had the dream? Mm -hmm. And I was on top of the mountain? Yes, sir. And I was looking down? Yes, well, in order to get back on top of the mountain, I have to be able to conquer these seven mountains. Okay. Okay. So you ain't up there to say, I made it. Mm. I made it. He said, no. If you up on a high mountain, then the seven mountains, y'all not saying that, mm -hmm. is in your hand to overthrow oh, what is not right because you have the authority you have the jurisdiction did y'all get that yes mother some of y'all yeah, that was powerful yes can i tell y'all another dream please. Please. Yeah, mother. i know y'all gonna say please can i tell y'all another dream let me see if they say yeah oh let me see if they say yeah okay. can i tell you another dream mm -hmm. i'm trying to wait till somebody say yeah you could tell it because, again, this is serious. Uh-huh. Can I tell you another dream? I'm waiting for you to say yes or no. No, keep going with the word. Y'all about to shine down. Glory to God. I'll wait till somebody say yes, you can do it. No, no, Sister Regina. No. Okay. Yes, mother. Okay. There go one. Yes, ma'am. Okay. All right. So, where we at? Thursday? So, I just came back from Cyprus. An awesome move of God. I went to sleep. I came home Monday, and I was so tired, y'all. I was so tired, so tired. And one of my boys said, Ma, go to sleep. I said, I'm going. And I slept. I slept. I woke up. I slept. I woke up. I slept. I woke up. And all in the time I'm sleeping, I'm seeing. Mm -hmm. This particular time, I go back to sleep. There was me and another young lady that walks in this room. We walk through the door. Why is she telling you? Hold on. Because <laughs> God is talking. We walk through the door into this four, I guess four by four, because it's the, you know, four walls. White walls. No furniture in there. So me and the young lady, whomever this lady is, could have been an angel, could have been somebody that I know, you know, uh, however. We walk in to this room through the door. So we didn't come up the wrong way. We went in through the door. When we went through the door, I'm talking to this young lady. As I'm talking to this young lady, I can see all around me, but she couldn't see behind her. So, in the corner appears an easel that's on the stand. I'm going to help y'all. I'm going to make y'all shout right now. A easel appears on a stand in the corner. Jesus Christ is the chief cornerstone in the corner. He sits at the right hand of the Father. This was from God. When the easel came, all of a sudden, 
I, 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 I just, you know, years ago just found out about him. But Apostle John Boyd Sr. walks through the wall. He walks through the wall and looks at the easel board. I'm looking at him. The young lady can't see him. All of a sudden, not many seconds later, he does it again. He walks through the wall at the easel board. He has on his robe of righteousness. He is young, glory to God, because his hair was more fuller. He was younger. That means he younger in his days. God was saying something. Lord have mercy. He walks to the easel board. On the easel board was black words. I could not see or, or, or be able to read it. When I woke up, I said, oh, my God, that was Apostle John Boyd Sr. Walked through the walls twice. Y'all not saying that. Yeah. And on the easel board was a black marker that was written. And I could not read it yet, but I knew it was words. And I said, God, what is it? What is it? It wasn't for the young lady. It was for me. I said, God, what is it? As I'm studying my word, I call up to my son and said, do you have one of those boards that you write on and erase? What am I saying? God, I love you. That what God did Monday, y'all not saying, he is now saying he walks through the wall. Y'all not saying nothing. I'm gonna see. And the easel, are you hearing me? It was like this, but I couldn't read the words. And I said, what is it? What is it? What was the words? He is telling me you brought the easel out, which means it's now time because it was done twice, which means it was established. And not many days hence, you're going to see what it was. Well, what was it? You're going back to the mountaintop. Here is the easel. He told me to ask my son to get a what? An easel and to do what? You can write on it and black marker and do what? Erase it. Jesus. I'm talking about Apostle John H. Boyd Sr. walked through the wall twice. Y'all not saying, it on my sakabo shanda. Huh? So what was God doing? He was bringing me to my new jurisdiction. And guess what? Another person that's of a different jurisdiction couldn't do it. A pastor could not do it. A teacher could not look at y'all looking at me. He is apostle. He is a chief apostle. He's going on to be with the Lord. Y'all not saying nothing. God, I love you right here. You and I need to understand what God has for us. We got to come up off this ground with these little chickens. Are you hearing me? And realize where we are at. And what these seven mountains is. Uh, did I tell you about the media? Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. The third one is the mountain of government. That's why some of us on here, as I get ready, slide on up out of here. Glory to God. Huh? Slide up out of here. Yeah. Okay. Because there's another jurisdiction that is about to come on. Oh, my. At 830. Come on, mother. <laughs> Y'all ain't paying nothing, glory to God. Because a lot of people be jumping all on here and everything. And I'm not talking about y'all. I'm talking about people jumping on Facebook Live. When you when they find out certain people is on, they want to jump on. Don't even realize that how you jumping on in a jurisdiction is certain jurisdiction is on. That's why, who is that? Nesbitt, she's in a certain jurisdiction. And people just jump. We don't even have a mind mentality. Oh, come on, mother. Come on. Ah. Now y'all oh, pound y'all ponder you. on that one. I got you. That was good right there. That was okay. That was powerful. You jumped in with the wrong okay. tradition. Mm -hmm. There's many you others, and I can and I can go on. I think I see Nixon on here. Uh, you know, yeah, so th there's others, and we don't sit here and don't understand if that jurisdiction. Why we on? Why why we on? Why we on at the same time? Got you. It's a difference if you at a conference or something of that nature. Right. But I'm talking about you on to teach. Yes. Yes, You're on to preach. You're you're on to give strategy. Right. At the same, at the same. We're not supposed to be on at the same time. Jesus, mother. Come on here. Yes. 
Is anybody listening or is everybody getting upset and getting mad? No, but because we don't know. I'm not talking about you at a conference and they got you on Facebook Live because you are doing what? You are an assignment. But if you're sitting and you teach it and you know another jurisdiction that's authentic, it's on. Why are you going to be on? Why? What are we doing? Damn. What are we doing? That's why we can't work together because it's, I got to get my peep. Ain't nobody getting no peeps. This ain't, this ain't us, this guy. But I got to move on because y'all going to say, you ain't give us no scripture. But I already told you this is a series. Yeah. And you're going to have a hang time and say, my God, I might have to come back because, whoo, she ain't really saying nothing. But she said something, but she ain't really saying nothing. And you know, for you little scripture people, don't worry, I got you. Okay. What I say? Mountain of government. Where evil is either restrained or endured. Where Mountain of government. And I was about to say this. Some of us that used to be on welfare, that's why you need to start shouting. Okay. Because God delivered you from a system that you were supposed to overthrow and Mother. change the laws. Mother. Y'all not saying nothing. Mama. But how am I make it? Because I ain't got my food steps. And y'all know I love my food and I can cook. I, how am I make it? God said, I just delivered you out of the government system of welfare. And you don't even see that I'm giving you the authority to overthrow legislations and laws. Because there's people out there that need it. That's why you don't need it. You Come just on. tripping. Come on, mother. Come on. Come on here. Yes. But because you don't know your jurisdiction. You want a handout. That's why you ain't got time for handouts yes. when you the one supposed to be turning things and changing things. Yes. Okay. Oh. Y'all not saying that. Not on both sides. And I tell my brother all the time, you walk up in there where you work at and you take authority. Yes. You take authority and call every last one of them services acting out of order, coming to the subject of the God that's in you. Mm -hmm. That everybody that walk up in there, come on here, somebody. Yes. yes. Okay, y'all gonna be all right, cause y'all better. Right. Y'all better come on. Let me see where I'm at. Where I'm at? All right, I got two minutes. I got two minutes. Come on here. What did I tell y'all? Government. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. The mountain, the mountain of energy, the mountain of religion. There's a difference from religion Ooh. and relationship. Ooh. The mountain of religion, uh huh, is where people worship God in the spirit. Or worship God in spirit and truth, or settle for religion rituals. We got we got in and out burgers now. We got in and out churches now. You know, long as we do, we do our two points, pray, three points, scripture, six points, break it down, nine points. Let's get to the car. Rituals, religion, and now half of us. Not all of us. Half of us has not connected with this craziness. Say, because we can't, we not been a whole people all day. You at your job you better tell signed up for eight hours and they didn't told you part time. You must come over. Then they tell you we need you to work a little extra five to six hours and you ain't complaining. You may complain when you get home, but you sure ain't gonna turn it down. And now you in church. I'm gonna say, this is too long. This don't make no sense. Let me go on over here to John Doe Church because they in and out. You got a, re a religious spirit. All the hell you going through, it's going to take a microwave to get you out. The devil is alive. Okay. Well, it ain't going to take no four to five hours. You're going to be all right. You're going to be all right. Because when you really get delivered, you want everybody to go home and tell us, yes, Lord, I'm going to blah, 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 blah. But see, some of us don't want out. That's why we want religion and not relationship. But those that want relationship, are you getting this? The mountain, the mountain of religion. Okay, the mountain of arts, that's entertainment. That's why we need to, we need to stop this foolishness. God calling you into the arts, the entertainment field, you better go ahead. Can I go ahead and help y'all? Go ahead, brother. Please do, talk to me. Um, talk to me right Tamala now. Tamala Man has a song with, uh, what's his name? Oh, God. Uh, uh, oh, God. Oh, Timberland. God. Timberland. Timberland. Yes. When they begin to play the song, everybody... Start tripping yeah. about Timberland. Yeah. I don't think the world need to be on the gospel song. The reason why you don't think that is because you don't understand the seven mountains. Go, mother. Come on here, Pastor. If the Lord 
Connect me with Snoop. Janet you, Jackson. You ain't come Beyonce. On. Yes. Jay Z. Yes. Shall I go on? Yes. Y'all go ahead and get y'all popcorn and talk real good. Hello. Why? Because they have influence. And you listen. Come just on, because mother. you saved, you ain't got to get with them while they drinking and getting high. Because it ain't about that. It's about going in and overthrowing what the enemy has done and take it back for the kingdom. So, oh, y'all. Is y'all okay? I'm good. Because I got to move on. Because I'm going to teach you about that when I get to that mountain. Yes, mother. Stop talking junk yes. and understand what Thank God you. is doing. Thank you, Apostle. There are mountains, seven mountains that we walked away from. Yeah, we walked away. Yes, we walked away. Yes. And yes. we talking to God, God, I need you to overthrow. They may, they may, yes, Lord. They, they, they told me I couldn't get my, I couldn't get my social security no more. They told me this. They told me I can't, I can't have this. I mean, they told me that they finna take this. And the Lord said, what you talking to me for, Moses? Why are you talking to me, Moses? Get up on the rock. Hold the rod out. And the atmosphere will listen and be conducive to what you said. Oh, y'all don't understand. Some of y'all scared to go in, in these type of entertainment fields because you really ain't saved. And then some of y'all scared because you don't know your jurisdiction. And some of y'all say, so because of the Go ahead, mother. See, I'm not going to sit there and be with the ones that's just coming out. Come on. Because my anointed and all, y'all not saying nothing, is for Snoop now. I'm saying something. Uh, you better come on, mother. I'm saying something. Yes, you are. Because of the level of demonic forces they walk in, it's going to take somebody that walks in the power of God in that realm. I'm just trying to teach us. You teach it, mother. We are not, we are sitting here and we are on elementary with all this. And we got the or that Christians, believers, in the corner talking. This ain't God. God wouldn't do this. God ain't finna yeah. put no secular. Well, you ain't even in the studio. See, you better come over here, Pastor. He uses the channel of the music. Y'all come up, oh Lord, Go help ahead, the people. Mother. But all we can do is talk about people. All we can do as Christians is begin to sit there and point fingers. Because you ain't got the jurisdiction to walk in that realm. You don't have the goods to overthrow this mountain. Oh, but I know where you at. Speak to the mountain and cast the mountain out the way. And it shall be moved. It's more to a mountain than just that. As I begin to run out of here, the mountain of family. Yes. The mountain. Yes. The mountain of family. Yes. Mm -hmm. Get that one. Ah. Mm -hmm. The mountain of family is where either blessings or curse is passed on to the next generation. And if we don't understand about mountains, if that very thing has not been come into the hands of God, then our children behind us is going to be cursed. Y'all ain't saying nothing. Y'all not saying nothing on both sides. Did I say everything? Ooh, no, I didn't. The mountain of business slash finances. Keep tripping about your money. Come on here. Bye-bye, Shonda. The mountain of finances. This is the mountain they all depend upon. What mountain? The mountains that I just spoke of, they all depend on the mountain of what? Business and money. Y'all not saying it. The education. They're looking to the business and the money. Come on, y'all. The government. Come on, y'all. Are y'all getting this? The entertainment. Come on, y'all. Whoever got the money, they got the power. Whoever got the money, that's why y'all be tripping. That's why y'all be tripping about Jake's, but y'all need to shut up because he's conquering the mountains. Yeah, that's right. That's right. But we tripping. We get, we tripping. We, God ain't in that. He got doing movies and stuff. God ain't in it. But I get, I bet, I bet, ooh, y'all make me stutter. Guess what? What? I bet you when the White House needs something. Oh, come on, mother. For real, for real. I ain't talking about these people that running up there. Here I am. No, 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 no. Yeah. Y'all better come on here. Y'all keep on tripping if you want to. Hmm. Keep on talking about people if you want to. Okay. 
Good. God is setting people in, yes. glory to God, into these places that I'm putting you on the mountain. And I'm giving you the I'm giving you the legislation. I'm giving you this order to overthrow this stuff. Y'all, come on. You ain't sitting at the board table. You don't know what's being said. You don't know what's being done, but you got all the stuff to say. Say what you want to say. Keep talking. My name is Vanessa Yovine. Y V O N N E Jackson until I get married again. So you got my name right. All by Shonda. Okay. And go sit there and put me in no cage. Because you don't know your jurisdiction. Because you don't know because you're religious. And God coming for the ones that got a relationship mm. and bringing you back to the mountain. Yes. Come on here. And not easily led. You better talk about it. And not easily persuaded. And don't care if you're talking. Because they're going to talk and give you more media attention. See? Go ahead about so you can do what God has called you to do, to go into the dark, to the to the power of darkness and then overthrow that. Yeah, but, cool. but oh, y'all too busy looking at all these people. And see, that's a liar right there. And see, that's what that's a cheater right there. And the and, and the person face that's coming to me, who's the who's the big guy? Go ahead, He's on there with a uh, pump daddy. Oh, 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 ooh. He's on the, he's, he the got door. this, he got this little pretty baby. He always got his baby with yes, him. Come I on here. What his, what is his name? What is his name? Uh-huh. Well, what, why you want to know his name? Because the Lord just brought him before me. In other words, God said, I'm going to connect you with him. So y'all can say whatever you want to say. Because when you don't know your jurisdiction and you don't know your assignment, then you're going to sit here and you're going to have a problem with somebody else's because you didn't take the time out. You too busy trying to run to the pulpit when you should be running to get on top of the mountain and overthrow these other mountains for the kingdom of God. Y'all find out that man named so right that. So I can speak it in the atmosphere. Y'all can say what y'all want to say. Talking about that ain't God. What's wrong with us? They, 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 didn't take, they didn't take the things of God from us. The slithered enemy did. And put it into the DJ Khaled. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There it is. DJ Khaled. That's who he just showed me. So y'all can sit here and I might say, that ain't God. Oh, no. Jesus sat with the sinner, was overthrowing the laws. Y'all ain't saying nothing. We too busy, don't even know our assignment. Uh, 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 Marjorie, God got you. There is in the jurisdiction, there is an oil anointing on you. Glory to God that God is bringing you back up to the top of the mountain. And glory to God, and you're going to be able to go into these different mountains, seven mountains. Y'all not saying nothing. And you're going to be able to overthrow the very things that is evil and bring it into the hands of the kingdom of God. Can anybody do that? Nobody can do that except God. Put that oil in assignment on your life. Y'all need to go pray somewhere and shut up. Yes. I wish she would bring this. You mean to tell me she over there at Beyonce concert sitting right there, and when you get done, I'm gonna go on back here, cause that ain't that ain't hyping me. That ain't making me wanna uh, go sit with no man or nothing, cause I know my assignment. And so as soon as she get done, come on back here, Apostle Jack, come going on. on. Yes, I am. Come on, mother. Say. Y'all not saying nothing. Say that. And why they back there cussing and stuff? Up, I shot down. They should be respecting you. You got to learn how to be wise. You got. Can I tell you something? Go ahead, mother. What did Esther do? You know, she, she, just, uh, uh, she disclosed who she was. What did Esther do? She shouldn't have to. Why? Because she queen. Come on, man. But her uncle said, do not say do who, not you say who you are. Who you are. Come on. Because there's going to come a time that you're going to reveal who you are. And they're going to need you as who you are. Y'all can stop all this reading the word and acting like God just giving us the word and we just, yep, Esther, yep, 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 and don't understand the thickness of it. Y'all can keep saying what you want to say. How you doing, lights? We fine. Keep on talking and getting in your little clicks and clacks and, and leaders and talking and all that stuff. Come on now. Y'all not saying nothing. Come on. Y'all not saying nothing. What name? Ray J. Yeah. What uh, name? What's the other one name in New York? Oh, got Simmons. Simmons. Russell Simmons. Well, See, y'all not ready for me. Y'all not ready for me because God already gave me the dreams. And and, and uh, Ray J say, uh, do that thing you do. Sure did. Yes, well, what he thing did. he talking about? Prophesy and tell him what thus said the Lord. Not no psychic. Not no demon. Y'all not saying nothing. On, Can you stay right there? But we sitting here don't understand that God want us, watch this, to take the mountains back. Yeah. But you ain't going to be, be able to be the one because you still with the chickens. Yeah. 
-hmm. And you still saying, what's God and what's not God? I, so I guess, you know, we just going to go on to heaven and then we just, and the Lord just going to let them just die off. That ain't, that ain't even a merciful God. That ain't even a good God. See, see, see. You I, I know, I know Trump is jacked up and everything. Trump, Trump, Trump. He playing the Trump card. What we don't understand is Trump doing all that. But you got to understand there's going to be a king that's going to be on God's side. God ain't done with Trump. Oh God ain't done with Trump. You right, Apostle. By Trump acting and doing all this stuff and talking to everybody. That, God get ready to use that man. But guess what? Those that's on the mountain going to realize and those that's down there, the chicken, they're talking about, look at them, look at them. No, read your word. When Daniel was on sea, King Darius was not a king of God. Yeah. Ooh, you better come on here, Apostle. Who is that? King Nebuchadnezzar was well, not a king of God. God. You right. Y'all, come on. Y'all do you not understand the word for 2018. You don't know how to understand the word. See, we were doing just fine when we had Obama. Yeah? Well, guess what? Now God said, get, get, I'm going to put somebody up in here that's going to work on my behalf. Are y'all getting this? Go back and read your word. Because, you know, go on back and read. <laughs> read the book of Daniel. Go on, go on and read it. Ooh, Apostle. Go on and read it. Yes, ma'am. Cause we sitting here, we saying stuff, but we reading the word, but we, but we don't even understand. God wouldn't, God wouldn't put Trump. God wouldn't allow Trump to get up in there. Yes, he did. Ooh, yes, he did. He was chosen for this season. Watch this to work the plan of God. If y'all could just hold on for a minute, things about to switch. Things about to change. What happened with Daniel? When Daniel was what? He got favor, influence with. Y'all come on. With Darius. Oh, oh, mother. Okay, tell him this. And uh, Shaq, Rack, Meshach, and Abednego. They told the king, you need to do what? You need to turn it up seven times because all this stuff. So he did it. But when Jesus walked up in it, he said, hold on, wait a minute. Then we, did, we put in three. What the world is happening? Please. Let him out. Come on here. Let him out. And the God they serve. That's the God we gonna serve. Oh, What's wrong with us? Oh. So we ain't ready for stuff like that because we tan everything down. That ain't God that put him in there that did not allow him to get in there. And if he did allow him to get in there, he not gonna stay. Well, what you think God finna do for us? God finna work this. Come on here. God finna work this. Come on here. I said God finna work this. Yes, mother. Are you hearing me? How y'all sitting here got mean and evil bosses? That serve witches and witchcraft and all that, and you working for Y'all need to stop this. On, and God mama. said, I put you in there to overthrow this witch. Oh, yeah. Okay, y'all, come on, y'all. But y'all too busy talking. I forgot you know everything, you know, and God wouldn't do that. Well, he wouldn't do that with you because you and he ain't chose you to do that. See. That wasn't your purpose. That wasn't your Jesus. plan. Karina Merritt, go ahead and do your thing, girl. Do your thing, do your thing, do your thing. Come on here. Y'all, y'all ain't ready for me. Y'all not ready for the ones that God has really chosen and they on top of the mountain to overthrow the seven mountains and come back into alignment with God. Okay, I got to close. I'm out. I'm out. And I'm both sighing. Y'all sit here. Oh, see, they don't. Uh -uh, we need to go on over here and get in and get out service. Go on and get in and get out. But guess what? God preparing me. He's, he's molding me. Mm -hmm. He's shaping me. Get cold. Shut up. My sake. Glory to God. And he already showed me. So it's already done. So either I'm going to listen to y'all that's talking negative and do not fulfill what he showed me or listen to him and keep walking with him and let the mouths keep talking and wagging. And then say, oh, she sold out. She went backwards. You and the devil is a lie because you didn't go into the meeting. You don't know what I said. You don't know what I pray. Can you pray? Vanessa, can you pray? I sure can. Father God, in the name, hold hands, everybody. Y'all keep playing. Y'all sitting here passing judgment on what God is about to do for you and do for other people that he has handpicked. Y'all, oh, come on. Okay, where am I at, y'all? Did I give y'all the mountain of finances? Mm -mm, I ain't done. This is the mountain they all depend upon. This is the mountain that... 
fields and fund all other mountains. For either people shall build for the glory of God or the glory of man. Where resources are consecrated for the kingdom of God. So you're going to build the resources will be consecrated for the kingdom of God or captured for the power of darkness. And it... <laughs> Well the, wealth of the, well, the wealth of the wicked is laid up for the just. It may be laid up, boo, but you're going to have to go into some of these places where it's laid up. Are, is anybody listening? And you can't go in and be and compromise. You go in there and show love. By this, you shall know that they are my disciples by love. And you're going to have the opportunity when the right time come, Esther. Put on your royal apparel, Esther. Now show them who you are, Esther, and watch a whole nation get delivered, Esther. I guess if y'all was back in Esther day, y'all be talking about, she shouldn't be up in that palace talking about she, she going through a beauty queen thing. Say that mother. ain't God. Say it, mother. That was good right there. Jesus. If that was You'll be plain. sitting over there on, on, on the other side of the palace. That ain't the Lord. That ain't God. She was born for that. She was born to overthrow a law. Father. That Haman tried to take out the people of God. I'm just, I'm just saying. Say it. So well, that's the introduction. It. How about that? My God. That's the introduction. What an introduction. Time to go back on top of the mountain. Don't you dare. My daughter's on here from San Diego. Don't you dare lose what God has placed you. Overthrow the laws. Overthrow it, but I'm gonna teach us some more. I got to go because there's another, there's another one that's on right now, and we all working together. Y'all not saying nothing. Yeah, see, that's right, daughter. Born for such a time as this. Are you getting this? Come on from the little chickens. That's why you keep getting caught and putting it all in the cage. But you, it's hard to catch an eagle. It's hard to catch an eagle. And the hawk trying to hang with the eagle, he can't even hang with the eagle. Y'all not saying nothing. We're going to deal with the top of this mountain. I done gave you some scriptures if you didn't know. I gave you Esther. Yes, you did. Y'all not saying I gave you David. I gave you Daniel. I gave you Nebuchadnezzar. I gave you King Darius. I gave you Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. Come on, I gave you scriptures. Yes. So until next time, go and pray and ask God, what jurisdiction are you in? And don't you dare let people put you in a place that God never ordained or anointed you. Y'all not saying nothing to a sister. Are you hearing me? How dare us overthrow your authority and try to walk in that place? Don't you know God will cut your fingers off? Yeah. Cut your big toes off. Yeah, okay, I'm just saying. Mm-hmm, I'm just saying. Cut the thumbs off. Cut the big toes off. Come on. It wasn't just roots just because they took the axe and cut his big toe off to slow him down. Those are symbolic. Come on, mother. Symbolic. You can't pick up nothing and you ain't got your thumb. You're going to need the apostles. What's wrong with y'all? You're going to need the prophet. What's wrong with y'all? Because the apostle can touch all five, all four. The prophet going to point the way. Come on here. Come on here, Father. Y'all not saying nothing. Ahead, we cannot do this like we did it in years past. God has taken some people to the mountain. And I say to you, if you are going to be one of them, let's go. And let's not be afraid of where we got to go. Of where we got to go. Come on here. See, I knew she was just trying to get all the people, and now she's trying to get on that TV screen. You crazy. Because while you're looking at the TV screen, you don't know what's happening behind the scene. Oh. Why somebody about to try to kill. Why, can I just, I got to go. What's that thing called? Illuminati? Yeah. Yes. What's wrong with y'all? Yeah. Illuminati is this, is a part of this. Is somebody in the family has to be sacrificed. Yeah. If you finna get the wealth and riches and all this, you ain't finna just get it. You gonna have to give up somebody. Are y'all getting this? Yes, mother. And the Lord is gonna send people in there that is not afraid to overthrow the law. Y'all not saying, 
We too busy on the outside talking. Yes, we too busy on the outside talking. Outside. And God trying to take somebody in as what snipers. Come on, I, I I like karate. Yes, I do. What's the one one go in? They did the, the ninjas. ninjas. They wear the black. You can't see them. Ninja. You don't even know who they are. Ninjas. Samurai. Are y'all understanding? Yeah. But because we listening to man and listening to people, and God said, I put you in this jurisdiction. Yeah, I'll put you behind the pulpit, and you can preach and prophesy, but I'm sending you to the White House. I'm sending you to the entertainment. Come on here. I'm going to call you to have a business. Come on here. That, that a devil is going to have to come to your business. Watch this. <laughs> Y'all got to get a bigger picture. Yes, yeah, spiritual snipers. So I'm, I'm not in this shallow water stuff. I'm going to the mountain. Are you hearing me? And it's not just a saying. That's Go true. to the mountain. And then the seven mountains, glory to God, watch this, has come up under your jurisdiction. We're going to hit that next week. We're going to hit it next week with scriptures. I believe y'all have enough to go on. I believe you have enough to go and pray and begin to talk to God about the mountaintop and talk to God about the seven mountains and where do I fit and talk to God, glory to God, what is my jurisdiction? Come here, by tell out of old sack, can't be my seat. Is anybody listening? Then everybody go home. You keep on playing like you want to be somebody. I'll stay humble. And do what God has called me to do. Y'all not saying nothing. Glory to God. Because I'm not going to go through all this hell. What I went through in my life. And, and this is it. Y'all can okay, get it. Y'all get it. I went through all what I went through. And this right here is it. Think about it. You ain't seen it yet. You ain't seen what God is about to do with you. But if you want to stay with the chickens. You go ahead and be my guest. Come on. You want to go on in there. Bob wires. You be my guest. And be like the Lion King where the little man said, let me in, let me in. And the other saying, let me out, let me out. You do you. All right? But there are some people on here. God is saying, I called you to the mountain. I called and chose you to stand on the mountain. Glory to God. And not only stand on the mountain, but overthrow. Overthrow legislation. Overthrow laws. Y'all not saying it. Yes, don't worry. Keep on signing your papers. Come on, get all the names. Go on and keep doing that. But y'all, we got to have the main ingredient. Are you hearing me? And they say, you know, because the man is saying, y'all get a thousand names and then we take it. Then they going to look at your situation. But just because they look at it because you got a thousand signatures, and I know it may be more than that, so y'all just go with a sister. Don't mean they gonna do what? Overthrow it. But baby, if you put signatures, cause without God, this thing is gonna be what? Impossible. Impossible. So while you getting the signatures, y'all not saying nothing. Glory to His wonderful name. You got the authority. Who got the authority to overthrow this? God. No, God has it, but who in the earth? Got the authority oh, got with the thousand names that's on it. Because as long as you just got names on pieces of paper and then you hand it to the people, hello, somebody, they look at it for real. Because they got to look at it. Because you got their attention with all these names. But just because they look at it don't mean they have to do it. We want to make sure if we're going to write a thousand or more names that this law is going to be changed. That this thing that was just for rich people it's going to be changed. But ain't nobody going to give you no handout now. Get up and do something. Are, are y'all getting this? So I'll sign your paper, but who's going in to represent the kingdom? I don't mind walking for cancer because God healed me. But who is in that, who is in, in that uh, uh, group walking that is overthrowing that spirit, that has the authority to overthrow it? Because if walking just did it, then none of us should be getting it. Right. If walking just does it, then none of us, none of us should be getting it. That was good right there. You got to be able to overthrow the law in the spirit realm. So as we come together and walk, that's unity. That's unification. But if there is no mouthpiece of the oil, <laughs> what about Sanda? Huh? We can raise all the money for that type of thing. Guess what? Research. But guess what? Nobody is in the midst with it 
overthrowing the law of it. Yes, Lord. I'm 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 just saying. There's quite a few of y'all on here that God came to tell you it's time to go back to the mountaintop. And don't you come down for nobody. Because where God put you, when my ministry started acting up, people didn't want to call me. You know, Pastor, they didn't want to call me no more. They didn't want to. Why? Because you hit your jurisdiction. And some folks just religious. How about Sanda? Y'all not saying nothing. Because, boo, you could be laying in the bed and throw bombs. Come on. You don't have to stand behind a pulpit and overthrow a law and bring it up under the jurisdiction of the kingdom of God. Are y'all getting this? I love you. I'm out. Until next time. Hallelujah. Until next time. Y'all know how we said, don't forget this Sunday. Glory to God. We are when the prophet speaks. Yes, we have a powerful woman of God that's going to be in our midst. Amen. And God is going to move, not because it's a woman, because it's the assignment. And it has been ordained by God. And so if you're anywhere in the vicinity of the Houston area, glory to God, in Cyprus, come on here, 7 p.m. Sunday, when the prophets speak, glory to God. We have uh, Prophet Jeremy Butler will be in the house. Glory to God. We have uh, Bishop uh, uh, um, Tony. Robeson, Tony Robeson will be in the house. Come on here. God got some awesome oil men and women of God. Not just to cause things to happen in the earth, but to begin to shake things in the realm of the spirit. He said, I'm going to shake it again. What he's going to shake? Heaven and the earth. So I love everybody. Glory to God. You be encouraged. You be encouraged and know that God is with you. He'll never leave you nor forsake you. All right? You go with God, and God, he'll go with you. May the blessings of the Lord make you rich, and it add no sorrow. It's time to go to the mountaintop. I invite everybody now, as you close off, find your way over to Prophetess Juanita Bynum's page because another general in the realm of the spirit is talking. God bless you.